Hi everyone, um, so I just said I'd do like a, just kind of a quick like a video um, maybe to kind of follow up on some questions like that I got let's like uh, um, as regards like uh, the kind of like uh, the second let's like a uh, palm change like uh, and the first like a uh, palm change and kind of just discussing like with uh, the kind of the principles like uh, within them so um, I, I mean just going through let's like uh, the kind of the shofar or the hand like a uh, maneuvers let's like uh, for like uh, the first like a uh, palm um, as I said like uh, before um, Wong when he was explaining like oh the 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 form like to me, he said pretty much everything kind of kind of be encapsulated like a within the first like a palm change everything else is just kind of like a variations like there afterwards, but um I mean like overall if you're kind of looking at let's say, like the first like you're kind of like initiating movement like you're leaning on the horse let's say, like you're asking the way, um there are like a kind of some kind of layerings that you can kind of do later on in the form like as you're kind of practicing it but there's really quite a lot of like a good like ideas as regards to like oh i'm chin now like or kind of joint locking like a within leaning on the horse like asking the way so just to kind of maybe just give a kind of a couple of like elements um i mean starting off let's like oh the one of the first like a maneuvers like oh um dragon like a plays like in the water i mean that can be used let's like oh, for a kind of a recatch or a grab let's say like oh, so you could have let's like a hand that's like a cart let's like go here someone might have placed their hand on you and you're basically just kind of taking it under and doing a quick turn let's like and kind of like a pull or yank um it also can be used let's like for kind of what's kind of commonly like referred to as kind of those small wraps like go around like or the the wrist locks like where you can kind of like go pull someone down like really quickly so that particular like a first movement like a dragon like a plays in the water and then leaning on the horse let's like go asking the way I mean, leaning on the horse, asking the way. There's a lot of let's like uh, maneuvers and joint locks like you can work off of that. So just as one example, so this particular one, let's like uh, here, this particular movement. If someone's let's like uh, catching you, let's say uh, you can kind of have an, an underhand let's like uh, catch to, to pin their arm and then just bring it bring it forward. That'll hyperextend like uh, their wrist. Um, also let's like go oh, as an as an underneath let's like go oh, kind of like a oh, maneuver let's like go oh, here you can also like go oh, bring it up and catch out like go oh, this way and then kind of maybe take someone down like go oh, to a kind of a side wrist lock like go oh, slash like go oh, into maybe like oh, an elbow like a oh, joint break or a, an elbow crank like go oh, um as well this particular like a maneuver like oh, if you've got a, a catch like oh, on the hand anyway you can prop up let's like go oh, here this coming upwards movement you can kind of prop up let's say like other the lock like on the wrist while also like a holding on like to the forearm and um, you can also like you use it like a for a really quick like elbow sublocation so like if you were in a position like you here someone grabs like with this particular hand you're basically coming coming up and hyper extending like you or sublocating like with the joint like from underneath so this hand will be caught here and then you've got a quick like go sublocation it's like a coming out it's like a from underneath like a that like as well um as i shown like in kind of like some of my other little like videos like a before with some of my students like the next kind of like a follow on like a move like a leaning on the flower let's like asking the way it's all about like the inner rotational let's like forces like you're going on there so you have basically leaning on the horse asking the way and that inner rotation like that goes on now that rotation should really kind of come from the transfer of your body weight like you and also like with the turn of your hip like you're moving as one the whole body's coordinated with the move but basically like with that particular like move can be used let's say like to supplicate like with the joint let's say like you underneath you can either use let's say like you the hand let's say like beneath let's say like go here propping it up this way and sublocating like with the joint it has to be really kind of like a pulled off really quickly the other one that i found that's like a quite useful let's when using that like in conjunction with a catch is basically by taking like with that particular per the, the leading let's like a hand bringing it down coming in with a palm strike and then as you're kind of turning away using let's like with this part of your body let's like with the the ribs like on the kind of um the chest like go area use that like as the fulcrum like go against the elbow and if you jerk it it'll 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 sublocate or pop pop um it can 
leaning on the horse asking the way also can be used let's say like as a kind of a a, a kind of a, a drag let's say like a kind of like a joint lock where maybe you grab like with the leading arm and you just basically bring it along like with that like holding onto the wrist so you're basically catching onto the wrist here laying laying the wrist along it and you're just basically just pulling it on like go to, to a quick let's say like a um, joint lock or kind of maybe you might get a supplication like with that as well same let's say like, with, like with, um, the flock of wild geese let's say like go break out I mean that particular like a move lifting up you've got a joint lock like a going on that's like a wrist like a catch like a compression bringing the person like a down um you can use it like as what's commonly referred to like as a z lock where the the hand is hyper extended let's like go this way so there's lots of different things you can kind of like do with that um the flock of wild geese let's like go coming coming out breaking out uh, there's a lot of like your kind of good maneuvers like go with that like where you've got a catch like you and you're basically either hyper extending the neck hyper extending like with the jaw basically using that as the fulcrum and you're you're kind of doing what's commonly referred to in Chinese martial arts like was mopping the brow where you basically catch like go the forehead of the person and you crank it like go back like you'd kind of let's like go put pressure on the back the shoulder or, or the neck like go if you're kind of trying to bring like the person like go down or do a quick like a take down it's like or, or knock down so that's kind of maybe kind of explaining in a little bit more detail like what i'm kind of talking about the nexus like within like the first like a palm like a change there's there's a lot of different like kind of um ideas like within it kind of moving on let's like you to um the kind of the second like a palm change as i kind of said before like a the second like a palm change is repeated like at a number of junctures like go during let's like go the the the, the form um it's 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 repeated let's like go at the very end and it's also let's like go repeated let's like go um at other like kind of sections of the form where it's basically being re-emphasized and like go there's a lot of like a value like go um to like with the second palm change in the jiang set where you're talking let's like the, the use of chuan jiang like the uh, this drilling so the drilling up and also like a chuang zhang which is the kind of the pounding palm like or the colliding or bumping like a palm so that that like a there's a number of like a different kind of like a applications of this like a particular like a maneuver so just to kind of maybe talk about like a couple of them like you know, that that were kind of emphasized to me by wang like and also kind of in exchanges with his other students um one of the first ones is kind of let's like you kind of a catch let's like underneath the or an underhook underneath the person's arm and you're basically compressing where you're either hitting like with the ziphoid process or you're cranking the neck back or the chin and um, hitting them another let's like go option is if you're on let's like with the outside you're you're basically kind of you've got a catch and you're basically snapping let's like go or hyper extending or cranking let's like go the arm let's like go at the elbow let's like go joint that's another like a common one um it can also be used let's like off on an on an inside where you're basically You've kind of you kind of like go brought let's like go in on this like go side and you're basically kind of coming in underneath and pounding palm like on drilling palm as well so you could be catching behind the forearm let's, and then pushing forward let's like go um with the at the wrist joint to kind of hyper extend let's like go the the the, the joint like go out this way so that's kind of some of the some of them other options like it would be if you've kind of gotten a, a wrap or an underhook underneath the arm. And you're basically let's like go got a catch like go behind like go the back of like go the the collar like go about here and you basically drive let's like go that like go in on that palm strike in underneath the chin like well unbalancing like with the person you've also got it let's like go as a kind of a an embrace like go from here let's say you kind of like go slide like with that hand through after doing an initial dissolving let's like go block and it's placed like go behind the back of the shoulder like go here as well and you basically just compress to kind of actually like go put, knock the person over or to kind of un, unbalance them like go basically to kind of lock out like go the, the lower back um the other like your kind of maneuvers like your like the golden rooster like your shakes its wings like your to re remove like a flower like your from the tree um and then it's like a remove like your the helmet like your from behind there's a lot of like a shui jiao like your kind of like your underhook grabs like your catches like your twists like your that you know you really need to kind of see it let's say, like go with a, with a partner like go to kind of like express them but i mean there's a lot of things like you can kind of like go play with like go with chuan zhang like go the twisting um and also like with the pounding 
I mean, one of the kind of like with the drills, like go from here, let's like we would have practiced would have been you meet the, the other person's arm, drill it up, drilling it up completely to actually basically put the person into a kind of a semi joint lock, like go here. And then you're basically kind of going like with various like with different options, like go to kind of hit the exposed, like a rib, like a pectoral, like a kind of area. So you could have basically like a pounding palm, like a this way. You could have a pounding palm, like to move them in. You could have a pounding palm, let's say, like to actually like go move them down and to kind of buckle them um, under their weight. You could have, let's say, like a, um, like a, a kind of a horizontal, like a pigeon, like a kind of like a chopping, let's say, like where you've kind of come across, let's say, like a, and you're looking to kind of maybe come in and maybe like you take advantage of like a, that, like a, that movement of the body so that you can then like a, maybe kind of come in, let's say, like a, with um, snake moves in the grass to basically like a, bring him to a side body throw or something else like that, like a, as well. But that's one of the the, th the things like a, that occurs like a, with playing like a trans and trans or chun, um, you're basically chun being like a, the the kind of the uplifting, let's say like a twisting, like a kind of a drill, like a screwing in, and then chuang like oh the the pounding, let's say like a palm, let's say like a, whether you're hitting, let's say like to move them back, to move to um, like to move them down, to move them to the side, etc. It all depends on what you want to do as regards like the kind of the follow up like a techniques or whether you want to put the person down or whether you want to throw them or whatever like the case may be. So that's just a kind of a brief synopsis of like of some of the other kind of things that you can do. Let's say that's just kind of responding to some of the messages like I've got like oh, etc. around like the first like the two pattern changes. Hopefully like oh, in the next like oh, coming couple of weeks, um, I'll be able to kind of like oh, meet up like oh, with some of my students like oh, once again, and we'll be able to kind of like oh, film like oh, some of these examples like oh, for you like oh, to have a look over like and share with you as well. Okay, thanks once again for listening. Have a nice evening.